Hi everyone, welcome to IT my channel. I'm Young. I'm excited to have you with me today about my new salary. I'm gonna say all the thing about how I can set up like this one. It's called Sketchy Bar. Did the first video on my mini salary, how to customize your on MasterOS to make it look clean and awesome when working on MasterOS. If you want to find all the thing I'm using, you can check out my DOS file. On this DOS file, you can find all the the software or the configuration I put on this GitHub repo, and also some dedicated tool, which means I didn't use much, so I moved this to the thing I I used to use. And you can find all the settings how I set up this one easily on my repo. What is sketchy bar? And you're gonna see this one. Uh, what I had right now on the top here, this is sketchy bar. You can cut um, my to whatever you want. You can define the item like for me here. This is the muscle X. A lot of things happen here. And on sketchy bar, you can define something like your customize. And this is example. And you can select all the features from this one. You can see. A lot of awesome example and how you can install this one just got to set up and you can find one by one and you can just customize as you want and what important here you should hide the original master x by which one the, the, the top here because if you have two at the same time it's very ugly and hard to reach i prefer sketchy by because it's more minimum ui and also this one is have made it like the chart is from like a lot of thing on the, the toolbar so you don't want that to happen and i also want to say one small tip when i set up with sketchy bar you often see when we have the dog bar on the mouse right like you can push on the left on the bottom but for now from my perspective i want to hide this one because you don't need this so all the time if you want to open something you just out tap and choose the thing you want to navigate to so if i don't want i just i just get on all tab and I'll, i know exactly what i want and open this one or i can just tie something to navigate to that one if i don't open yet so for me the way i see here i should hide all the dog so this is the command you just copy all the thing here post on the terminal and if you want to restore, you copy everything here, it's just three line and copy this one. Now I go to terminal. So if I go to terminal, I buy this one. So now I'm going to see, I got, I have three small dog here. And as I say, I, I don't want this happen. So I just hide all the dogs. So it's more cleaner for me and just three line is go away. On, I also want to say one more thing important here because from the owner of the sketchy bar, you're gonna, gonna follow the reports dot they have the dot file. All the dot file here that you can find the sketchy bar setup. And he also said previous version with, with me from Sashrip. Yeah, I, I would prefer you the lure, it's like this one, you start tab sketchy bar lure, X bar lure here. And if you want just one clip just copy this one and you're gonna install all the thing and if you want to more deep dying on what is this one you can find on the repo and you can see he installed all the package for you then install sketchy bar it install the phone side and one more step this is just sketchy bar phone side this is the library in low script so you can customize modify as you want and this step here he cloned the repo from his dot file and then he moved only the, the sketchy bar config to your and he just restart the sketchy bar so you can find all the thing here this is the sketchy bar this, this is what we want on this video and at it's written on lower so it's quite easy if you have working with new vim you're gonna get the idea so the, the, this is entry point, the init file, and then they have the bar, and you can just have all the item under the item. You also have the init .lo file. On this file, you're gonna see what is saw on the, the file. And for me, I had a similar setup. Let me show you. 
So this is my local variation of, as at this moment. I want some simple. So let's say I open this with my editor. And then what I often want is just the init file. So under the init file, so you're going to see this one. So they have the bar, they have the default, they have item. On the left, you get on the C. Okay, this is the wikis. I had the CPU on the top here. And that aerospace, just the window manager. So what I use right now. And that Apple is just this icon. And if you open the file, you're going to see the white define. You can um, define the icon, define the label, the background color. And whenever you do want to check uh, some action, you can define the strip to run this one. And similarly, I had it's just all the thing I want. If, for example, here I had a spy. This is original spy, but now I don't need this one. I just keep it simple. So the current spy. Whenever I want to open this one, that spy here. So you see, this is the current focus one. And on the right hand side, this is a CPU. When I click on CPU, you're gonna see open the activity monitor and this volume. This is the battery and the day. So that will perfect for me. Thank you. See you next time. If you had any feedback on, on my content or on this mini series, let me know because I gonna have a, one more, maybe two more videos like this one on my series. See, bye bye.